Hello viewers, welcome to my channel Lightning Solution. Today I will discuss another uh, programming topic on ASP.NET which is uh, Crystal Report View uh, in ASP.NET and C using C programming language. So let us discuss in this uh, slides. Uh, this is uh, first uh, I will uh, discuss the requires of the components for the uh, crystal report uh, this is uh, since crystal report is uh, no longer with the uh, visual studio so it should be downloaded from safe SAP website separately and the person for uh, visual studio 10 and above I will uh, so the next piece oh yes this is the version cr4 vs underscore 13 underscore zero uh, this is uh, above 2010 version and it should be downloaded and uh, then installed in your pc where you are to you are to project uh, a program uh, crystal report in ASP.NET C -surf. Uh, that is uh, in the project you are preparing for uh, ASP.NET uh, using C -surf language so you see install the crystal report software uh, this is very uh, user friendly so and after installation you should go for the uh, preparation of a report in crystal uh, using crystal report uh, create a small software program first in asp.net uh, the programming language should be c -surf for this purpose and I will show the screenshot of this project one by one uh, connect your front end and to database uh, uh, to database support suppose uh, my my software is SQL server database and the database name is salary so uh, next uh, you add and uh, step and uh, steps for uh, adding a crystal report is here right click on the project and add new item and select uh, crystal report and then and the next window will appear using report wizard uh, select uh, as a standard which is uh, easy to create and uh, next skin so this uh, the skin will appear to create a new connection uh, with the SQL server database and then select OLEDB option and uh, next uh, select the OLEDB provider for SQL Server the screen so this will be here and uh, the configuration screen says the server name here the dot will the root server which will use the administrator and uh, password and username a uh, standard uh, which has has been always used at assay assay here and I have given a small assay and data is uh, is uh, salary and the uh, integrated security is uh, true for always uh, the available of crystal report connectivity so next uh, next is summary of this uh, the interfaces so click on finish to establish the connection with and the tabs. next you see uh, the table option is there that table will shows uh, the tabs will be so seen and then table is to select from this and click on this arrow button and uh, next uh, 
that uh, we'll click on finish after uh, standard design so the page of crystal report uh, 3 is here my screen sort is here and the table is shown here next page shows the fields and uh, the fields are these are the i have uh, designed the field of uh, table personal info and drag and drop uh, to the crystal report layout details area drag and drop and uh, next uh, add a button uh, with a page here i have the page default for and button is uh, renamed as show report and uh, also add the crystal report from reporting options uh, report this is called crystal report viewer to incorporate the crystal report in this area and uh, add of this code in the library function import library function for data and sql client and uh, the crystal decision is shared and the crystal decision and uh, the driver is uh, crystal reports dot engine to be called on in the program into the praise and this is the level functions to import into the page using crystal decisions dot report apps are also required uh, to play with the page and the detailed code is here i have prepared uh, in my program i will show in the next video the pre uh, detailed practical just you understand that this is sql connection uh, that sql command create this uh, select statement and adopter is to uh, take the data fetching from this uh, table and data set will add the uh, pointer in the area data table and da is filled with this data set data and uh, report document is created with crp1 for crystal report page and crystal report page load with the uh, detail page crystal report three dot repeat which is i have already created and uh, then i have to give in this part ds dot tables personal info for this report area and uh, viewer will hold this report source that is crystal report and it will transfer to the browser with the command export to http response export format type dot portable format response falls from the table personal info and when this is done then connection will time out uh, next screen will shows the detail code is here for your convenience you can copy it and type it accordingly and uh, next screen will which uh, the runtime page and i will click on this debug that is run without debugging the software page uh, this is my browsing page for this uh, report page click on this show button show report and that then it will show my report is on pdf format and uh, since the crystal report is supporting the wider view it will uh, support the download option and uh, the printer option is here so i think it is easy now for you to create crystal report using visual studio uh, project thanks for viewing and welcome to my next video for uh, detailed practical thank you